Hey guys, how you doing today? Um, I want to do a quick unboxing. Um, I've actually had this for a while and need to start using it. Went over to Harbor Freight and got the airbrush compressor kit um, because I want to start, you know, airbrushing bodies and different stuff. Um, box had a little bit of damage, but actually all of them did. Um, there were like three or four. Um, this one actually came out of the back room and had less amount of damage, but, you know, all those deals. But it's got the, uh, the, uh, compressor itself, uh, 58 PSI, says quiet, so we'll see how quiet it is. Um, and then, uh, it's nice because it comes with the, uh, airbrush itself, a bottle, and uh, some different stuff. Looks like it's fairly decent quality. It looks like it's all aluminum or metal. Um, doesn't look like plastic junk, which are basic instructions. Uh, and air hose. That's nice. It's braided and it's got metal uh, metal lens on it, so that's not some cheapy stuff that's good um and then we'll see how we can oh probably not gonna be able to get this out i'm gonna put this down for a minute All right, now I'm back. Um, had to fight with it just to get it out of the case. Um, here's the airbrush itself. So I'm gonna get this out of here. Never had them days. Everything you touch just issues. <laughs> You got your gravity feed uh, cup. Airbrush itself looks really good. I mean, it's, you know, metal quality. It's not some cheap plastic thing. Got your wrench, bottle, um, siphon feed bottle. And then it's got the gravity feed cup. That's good. Oh. And there's your compressor. Let me set that up. Got a handle on it. Um, a carrying handle, that's cool. Uh, this thing does not look like some cheap, you know, pile of junk or anything by no means. I'm actually kind of impressed with it. Um, got a nice gauge going up to, going up to 100 pounds of pressure, but you're not going to run, you know, 100 pounds of pressure on a freaking airbrush or blow the airbrush up. I'll probably try to run, depending on what I'm doing, um, and what kind of paint I'm using. That's the thing that's all new to me right now because I'm used to airbrush and, um, auto air. Auto air um, custom paint stuff for you know motorcycles and race car helmets stuff like that like I used to use, um, but now I'm going to uh, the uh, Createx um, stuff and uh, some of the different stuff that's out there. So I'm gonna have to kind of work with a little bit, see how it thins out, how much reducer and air pressure and everything. But I mean, yeah, this compressors. Not bad. Got little rubber feet on the bottom. That's cool. Um, on off switch. Thing's pretty nice little deal. Um, 
Cool. Well, I see we've got a see we've got a little petcock on the bottom for draining your water out. That's always a needed thing. Um, whenever you airbrush, you got to have airbrush paint, whatever. Um, you got to have something to drain the oily water out of it, or you can ruin a paint job quicker than um, anything. But anyway, guys, um, yeah, just wanted to give you a quick uh, deal on it and um, quick review of it and just or an unboxing. I'll do a review on it after I use it a little bit and kind of, you know, see what it's all about. But um, I think it was 80 bucks for the whole thing um, at uh, Harbor Freight. So, like I said, you know, definitely, uh, definitely worth checking it out and seeing what I can do with it. Um, ought to be... Uh, That'd be pretty cool. So, okay, guys. Well, I hope you're all doing good out there. And uh, you take care. We'll talk to you soon. Thanks.